Welcome to yet another episode and today we are going to be making beef stew with Irish waru. So let's get started. Fry the onion until golden brown. So during this episode we are going to be meal prepping and cooking at the same time. It's, it saves you some time. So when the two go hand in hand, probably you don't have time, you can just get right into it. Let's add some garlic and ginger, you know, that turns the food from bleh into magic. Ginger and garlic, always have that in your meal. Then chopping up the green pepper and the coriander stalks, you know. Like when you cook the stalks together with the onion, the flavor is out of this world. All right. Continuing with the milk. Continuing with the meal prep, the carrots. Chopping them up. Onion golden brown. Adding in the green pepper and the coriander leaves. Stalks, sorry, the leaves will come later. The stalks all cooked up. Add in your carrots, cover to simmer so that the, the carrots can soak mm -hmm. in. Pre boil your meat, it helps you with less cooking time, with less frying time. So, this is pre boiled meat, chopping it up into palatable cubes, palatable size cubes, mixing it up. To get the flavors now prepping the eggplants to thicken the soup and chopping up my tomato as well eggplants and tomatoes this is going to give a nice thick gravy and of course miswaru made it here irish potatoes just two small ones to also thicken the gravy and for that amazing taste, let this cook. Keep mixing so that it does not get burnt as well as stick to the pan. The if you best know, taste. you know, Royco, the new edition, curry and muchuzi is the bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. I'm diluting this with a little water. Queen. And the best of the best, the Royco cube, just one will do. Add the same to the Royco choosy and if the reigning king, know. curry powder, Simba Mbili. If you know, you know. A little of that as well. That's the only spices that went into this beef stew. So dilute that with a little water and add into your sauce. I love how the color just changes let Ooh. it simmer Ooh. <laughs> my goodness delicious salt to taste i will always add salt at the end so that it so the meat the does Irish not become tough or the potatoes just enough soup for your gravy once everything is ready we go in with the leaves the coriander leaves so garnish and also the the leaves once they come at the end they are amazing they don't have to cook 
so much. Oh, look at that. Ready to eat.